before the show begins, I want to give you a quick announcement. This week, we have received a big announcement by the cat himself, Stumpy, stating that he finished recording his 800th episode special, the last numerical milestone of Lovely World. He wanted to inform the audience publicly that Lovely World will end this year. So as to not be a huge shock to everyone when it does hit the finale. However, despite the popular belief, Lovely World is not ending at 800. In fact, he has confirmed at least a town build and a minigame that is fully planned. This also means that this is not the last month you'll be seeing us. Be sure to subscribe so that you'll know when there's more news to come. Not just for Lovely World, but after, since Stampy has no current plans for Minecraft content after Lovely World, so I will most likely focus on Hermitcraft, Empires, or even Life SMP for the time being. If you like what you see, please leave a like, because it really does help the channel out, and to get out to more people. Now, on with the show. Welcome to Lovely World Good News Broadcast, where all your lovely and not-so-lovely news reside. I'm your host, Sophia Bengal, to bring you the news that has occurred during the month of April. This month has a huge focus on the Funland, with Stampy working on the Funland entrance by creating a tunnel and using portals as a way to make a cool way to get into the Funland. Although, it doesn't look as cool as it does with Ray Tracy. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look as cool at all. Just look at that. Look at that. <laughs> After he finished the Funland entrance, Stampy, William, and Polly start work on the new minigame. Or more like a full-on game at this point. Of the golf course. If you are confused, um, Stampy made a mini golf course back at the very start of the series. But he wanted to fill out some empty spots in his world. So he decided to do so by making a golf course with... Interpols, interpols, and begins. <laughs> However, it doesn't go as smoothly as planned, since Stampy f fails to fall into the pit to enter the Funland, deciding to make it bigger in the next episode. Benton also has a little mischievous streak, attacking William unprovoked or unprompted. There are also a few post-credit scenes where he solves the mystery of how he got glass in his inventory. <laughs> that is worth a watch, if you want to watch that. If you missed that, you should watch that. Yes, you should watch. <laughs> the hole for the entrance of the Funland is fixed in the next episode. Now finally, Stampy approved. Oh, the real question is, ask is whether or not it's scar safe. Probably not. <laughs> Stampy knows that if you miss this drop, then it's more on you than it is on the pit or stabby or anything else or the design or you know you can't really blame him for not making it big enough because it's big enough <laughs> he nearly finishes the game by filling in two holes and then coming again in the next episode he finishes the next one the next couple holes and he finishes them up off camera then he and the developers also agreed not to play beforehand so that everybody could have a fresh look and no practice. So everybody is on the same page, which is probably smart. Now we can get to the results of the minigame, which is definitely interesting. The results of the tournament is quite surprising, as Stampy finally breaks his losing streak of coming in last for every minigame. Unfortunately for William, he did not have a lucky of a, as lucky of a start, but he still managed to pull through with the most improved player of the game with 22 points. Fizzy was 19, Polly was 16, and Stampy with a total of 14 points. There are also reports that Stampy is rapidly aging and getting older. His vision is getting worse, and he is no longer sprinting. People are suspicious that Fizzy hasn't been the one putting all those potion traps everywhere. But that is the work of Hit the Target and Beaver Dash. Regardless, next week we will celebrate the 800th episode of Stampy's Lovely World. 
the last numerical milestone with more to come. That's all I have this for you this month of April. Thank you for tuning in. My name, is, name has been Sophia Bagel, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day.